Okay, hey, thanks for joining me. Don McDowell here from uh, huntingfishing.com, Don McDowell Outdoors. We're going to do a couple of uh, product reviews. We try to bring all the, uh, you know, the pertinent information. There's a lot of good uh, good products out there, and there's some that aren't so good. Recently, uh, I had an opportunity to take a look at uh, changing calibers uh, for personal carry. Uh, first, first choice is uh, 45 ACP. And I got to think, well, you know, maybe I, I ought to take a look at a 40. So doing what I do, uh, I went from a uh, full size uh, 1911. This is a Colt uh, Combat Elite uh, Series 80. Uh, it's had some work done on it. We'll, we'll talk about that another time. But I, uh, I decided because of the uh, conceal issue to uh, perhaps look at a 40 caliber revolver and there's a couple on the market uh taurus has one this happens to be a charter arms um i'm not real happy with it uh let's just say uh shooting a 40 caliber rimless is uh, a challenge and if you see down the uh down the chamber there's a couple of notches uh in there that engage the uh right below the rim of the uh uh, I don't think the, uh, the quality of the pistol is, is what it should be. Uh, the finish uh, basically sucks. Um, I'm sorry to say that. I, I, was, I was pretty disappointed. Uh, we're going to talk about Taurus. Back in the day, Taurus uh, was known as a very inexpensive throwaway gun. Uh, I own two now, a 38 and a Judge. Uh, we'll, we'll talk about those uh, as we move through. But uh, I, I, I would just say uh, this pit bull uh, looks good. Uh, fi the, the finish on it is just uh, uh, really inferior. So, you know, I looked at some product reviews uh, on YouTube, and uh, those guys are full of crap. So I'm just saying from my, from my standpoint, what I did do is uh, Decided to go back to uh, 45 automatic, uh, my uh, weapon of choice, and kind of zeroed in on a Springfield Armory XD subcompact 45 ACP. Uh, this particular one has a uh, extended magazine. Uh, it's kind of a double stack, uh, 12 plus one in the in the pipe. Uh, the grip zone, as you can see, uh, it's got uh, some pretty good texture. And uh, very happy with it. it. It tucks away in your waistband uh, quite nicely. Uh, I'm going to talk about uh, some other uh, concealed carry uh, stuff as we move through. But I wanted to share that with you on the on the charter arms. The 40 caliber is a great, great caliber. I uh, like it a lot. Uh, 45 can't beat it. If uh, you get hit with a 45, something is not growing back. It makes a great. Uh, personal carry so that's it for uh, charter arms just beware uh the other 40 caliber on the market like i said is a taurus uh both of them are extremely hard to find so especially right now the way uh, society and uh, uh america is acting up with the left-wing democrats and uh go trump 2020 i'm don mcdowell the bass daddy hunting and uh, we'll be back with more